Hello, this video is for we configure the router switch and PC and this is for PCs is static IP setup for PC so first we have to configure the PC so we need to select the PC so we need two PCs and one switch and one router so router should be anyone you like here and one you have switch two switches here and you can select the switch here okay and first we have to connect through the cables so here the straight through cable so we connect to here to here and fa0 port and again this pc1 to f PC1 to FA02 here, FA02 port, and we have to connect router here to F3 to F00. So this all connected. First, we have to set up the desktop for static IP. So we go here, and here we select the IP addresses so we click here and type the IP address it should be 192.168.5.100 and default subnet mask should be 255 255.255.0 and default gateway should be 192.1 68.5.1 and close this and this one we set up here like 100 and this one should be 120 so we have to go here desktop again and set up the IP address the static IP so 192.168.5.100 so this all configured and we have to change the IP address for this so go to 192.168.5.1 and set this up here and we have to set up the default gateway for this router to switch so we go here CLI mode say no enter and enable command for router inside so you can go and just config t configure terminal see config t for configure term, terminal so we have to configure fast ethernet 00, zero. so I N T E R F A C F A C F A zero slash zero where the default gateway we have to set up. So we have to connect IP addresses one ninety IP address A W S address one ninety two dot one sixty eight dot five dot one default subnet mask is two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot zero enter no shut and enter so when we go here and this look like all connecting right so we have to go here it should be connected soon so first we have to check like here is the circle for that color so you can choose any color you like so this IP address is here say one ninety two dot one six eight dot five dot one twenty and the other one is here go back 
back here and this one is 192.168.5.100 so this two IP address here and this is the main route default gateway is here so default gateway I just mark here so you know the IP address for this so 192.168.5.1 so this is the default gateway so we configure all and we have to check if it's work right it's look like it's up and it shows here when you hover the mouse is one so we have to click here go to CMD mode command mode and type PING ping command for check if it's working 192.168.1.5.1 enter and it's a reply from the main router so it's good so we can go back and we can go here 5.100 enter and it's reply from the 100 so we can go back and check 120 is working so we have to check here 120 is enter and it's apply from this one too so we configure all the static IP and the static IP is very important because you can set up your any personal computer at home or you want to set up an office so you know where you put the static IP so if you restart your computer or router anytime it goes for the static IP so this is and we have to check with the packet so we just put here and check this the receiving packet so I just put both sides so it shows it's working so we go here simulation so we start and it's look like working right so it's receiving the packets so it's look like they're receiving packet from each other is my check mark so it should be good and thank you to watching my video if you like and subscribe my channel solo actor appreciate it thank you